Let's be clear what the fourth way does. It does not eliminate or obliterate everything we've learned before. It does what all sensible change does. It looks back to the past and takes and keeps and renews the things that are valuable and discards those things that are no longer useful. So from the first way it keeps and renews innovation but ditches the inconsistency. From the second way it keeps the sense of uh, urgency and accountability and equity but abandons the over-prescription and excessive standardization that really takes away professional motivation and engagement. From the third way, it takes the importance of data and of people working together, but now working together across schools for their communities and bringing in their judgment and their experience uh, to conversations, as well as the numbers and the targets and the cells and the spreadsheets. And then from this, it builds a few more principles that are very distinctive and very important. At the core of these is the idea that what matters most, what drives you, what lifts you, what pulls you together, is having some kind of inspiring dream of what you want to be before you decide how high you want to be. So the third way is really about being world class or being top or raising the bar or narrowing the gap. The fourth way is really about what kind of person you want to be, what kind of contribution you want to make to the world, what your school will emphasize, what your district or your state is about. The first thing is the dream and that, that drives, articulates, animates everything else. The second is really then about what does the teaching and learning look like within the fourth way. In the third way, it's about personalization. It's a, which really amounts to whether the learning is faster or slower, online or offline, with other people, by yourself, in your learning style, out of your learning style. The third way is about making access to learning more flexible. The fourth way really challenges the nature of learning itself, asking, uh, is it connected to you as a person? Is it related to your life projects? Does it engage you with the world? Is it mindful? Do you sometimes slow things down? and reflect as well as speed things up and try and get the next task done, the next unit, and the next bit of online instruction. Then once you've got teaching and learning, uh, you do of course need accountability. And this has two elements that look a bit different in the fourth way than in the third. You do have targets about where you want to be, what your goals are as a student, as a class, as a school, as a district. But your targets in the fourth way are set by you together as a community, as a group of professionals, which are usually more ambitious and more likely to stick uh, 